Hey guys, uh, Rick York here. I'm with Carport Central. Just want to touch base uh, and go over a couple things that tend to be an issue when people call in. Uh, everybody needs to get their ground level. That's one of the first questions that comes up is how do I do that? So what we're going to do is going to create a little short video just to show you what's going on. If you'll uh, take a look here, I'll step back and you can look at the site. Uh, actually, it, it appears pretty level. Uh, we've, uh, we've just recently put gravel in here back in the fall. And so you've got a situation that looks level if you just don't look at the orange trees. But let me show you something. What I did is I, I was actually placed four stakes in the ground. This is an 18 by 20. And so uh, for a potential garage, that's a pretty common size. So what I did is I put four stakes. I went to down to Lowe's or Home Depot and I got some masonry cord. We've got about seven, eight bucks invested here. So this is something that's truly important because if you're gonna get your building inspected, um, it has to be level and of course it's just going to make it more user friendly if it is level for you know even if it's a non-certified building uh, so if you will Jody uh, let's take a look here I'll show you at this point in the front it is six and a half inches okay so going backward we're going to face the building the potential building this way so going backwards we come down here and as you see the, the ground has a lot more drop than you would anticipate so down here, we're at um, almost 18 inches. Now I've already leveled this up, but I'm gonna show you what a bubble level looks like here shortly. If you'll follow me this way, go to this lower corner, we can look at the bubble level and I'll show you how to adjust it to get it level. If you will, Jody, come, uh, come over and let's take a look at the level, okay? All right, so this is a bubble level. It's common in any hardware store. So what you do is you simply bring your string up and when the level gets between the two black marks, if you can see that, should be getting level about here. There we go, okay? So at this point, we're level. So we're also 19 inches off the ground. So this particular potential garage it's 19 inches on the back side, and if you follow up back to the front, it was six inches off of the front corner. Or about seven inches here. So what you could do, uh, we can build on any level surface. We use ground anchors if it's a ground install. Of course, if you're doing concrete, your concrete guy's gonna know how to do this. There's also a, a more sophisticated way to do this with uh, technology, but this is the old school way to do it. So you've got six inches to 19 inches. So we just wanted to show you how important it is to, to get a building uh, level and have the site ready before we get there because we do no site prep. And uh, one more time, Rick, those four steps on what we did here. Okay. We got four posts. Four posts, masonry cord, bubble level, a hammer and stakes is pretty much it. And then you just measure from the ground to the cord each time in each corner to determine how out of level it is. And then at that point, you take um, your, your concrete guy or your gravel guy can come in and, and take care of what you need, okay? So thanks again. I, I've tried to keep it short, but uh, we appreciate your business at Carport Central. And again, this is Rick with Carport Central. Thank you much.